Hello, my name is Fatima. I'm an architecture student from University of Minnesota. Ralph Rapson Hall belongs to College of Design in University of Minnesota. It is named in honor of Ralph Rapson, a distinguished modernist and former head of the architecture school. Rapson Hall was originally built in 1960 and it was fully renovated and expanded in 2002. As an architecture student, I'd like to introduce you to the various part of the building that are unique and interesting to see. So, let's take a tour inside the building. As we enter the building, there is the Dean's Office to our right and a 260 seat auditorium to our left. Now let's turn to the right. As you can see, the walls are all covered with corkboard so that it allows the students to pin up their projects and present their work. Yes, we don't have presentations in classrooms. We either present our projects in the courtyard or in the hallways. In this way, whoever is passing by can see our work. I think one reason of this open presentation is that as future architects, we should get used to presenting our work in front of the public. These are some movable panels that work as presentation boards in the courtyard. Now you can see the courtyard. I think this is the space that makes Rapson so special. It is an enclosed space that makes you feel like you're in an open courtyard. This is because of its large scale and the ribbon windows around it. The courtyard is the place of social gatherings, events, presentations, studies, and meetings. Now let's take a brief look at the imaging lab, the computer lab, our laser cut room, the wood shop, and lastly our drafting room. These places are all essential facilities for architecture students to make models and do projects. As our final destination, let's take a tour to the architecture library. The library is my favorite place in Rapson Hall. Not that I'm a bookworm, I love it because it is such a great and colorful place. It has unique and colorful furniture that were designed by noted architects. It is flooded with light and it has some private and comfortable nooks that you'd long to be there and spend some time either studying or even resting and enjoying the large windows and beautiful views. Usually, there is an exhibition in the library that is nice to see. I think your library is one of the best places on campus that are worth visiting. At the end, I want to show you a glimpse of what architecture students experience in their studios. Just in case you think architecture is a fun major and its building is a nice place to be, it is beneficial to you to have this image in mind. I hope you enjoyed our tour. Hope to see you soon in Rapson Hall.